Welcome to Act Notes Tutorials, my name is Alice, and I am going to give you a quick tutorial on the Configuration Management Plan, or what I call the CMP. What is Configuration Management? We need to understand Configuration Management before I describe the Configuration Management Plan. Configuration Management is the application of sound program practices to establish and maintain consistency of a product or system evolving technical baseline over its life. The definition of configuration management is a systems engineering process for establishing and maintaining consistency of a product's performance, functional, and physical attributes with its requirements, design, and operational information throughout its life. What is a configuration management plan? A configuration management plan is a document that informs project stakeholders about configuration management within a project, describe the configuration management tools to be used, and how they will be applied on the project. The configuration management plan details the methodology that the program manager and systems engineer will use to control program documentation and the program, technical, functional and allocated baselines. The definition of a configuration management plan is a management tool that defines, documents, controls, instructs, implements, and manages changes to various components throughout a project. The purpose of a configuration management plan is to define a project's structure and methods for identifying, defining, and baselining configuration items, controlling modifications and releases of configuration items, Reporting and recording status of configuration items and any requested modifications. Ensuring completeness, consistency, and correctness of configuration items. And finally, controlling storage, handling, and delivery of the configuration items. Here is a notional outline for a configuration management plan. The first section is introduction, here you discuss purpose. Background, Scope, Document Overview, References. The next section is System Overview. This is where you give a brief description of the project and its goals and objectives. The next section is Configuration Management Components. Here you describe Organizations and Responsibilities, Configuration Identification, Change Control, Status Accounting, and Reviews. The most important section is the Configuration Management Process section. Here you describe Process overview, classification, evaluation, modeling and testing, implementation. The following are the remaining sections. Establish change control board, and appendixes. A configuration management plan template can be found on the webpage. Thank you for watching this tutorial on the configuration management plan. For more information to include a template, please visit the webpage. Congratulations on finishing this tutorial and thanks for visiting ACT Notes.